Can you do big things from such a small place? Don't think about such things. Why not? You'd be disappointed. When I first read The Queen of Katwe, I was about 10 pages in when I broke down and cried because I had been so inspired. Young girl, come inside. The thing that really struck me when I first read the script was how heartwarming it is, how full of joy in spite of a very difficult life these people manage to have. Why are you letting her win? I'm not letting her. The story came from an amazing young man at Disney who is Ugandan called Tendo Nagenda. He was in Kampala for a family reunion and he told me about Fiona, this extraordinary young girl who became the Ugandan female chess champion. Checkmate. 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 She won. You could be the best in all of Uganda. Good. How can I become a champion? I have lived in Kampala, Uganda over 27 years. And it is such a privilege making a film about Katwe in Katwe with people who are the heartbeat of the original story. You must never surrender. The true life, Robert and Fiona, are with us on set every day. And they're always an incredible source of both inspiration and authenticity. Sometimes the place you are used to is not the place you belong. You belong where you believe you belong. Where is that for you? Medina, she is from the streets of Chibuli, which is the neighbor slum of Katwe. And she has been on her own, much like the real Fiona. We were shooting a scene on the street, and Medina turned to me and said, this is my story, I've been here. I think it just put things in perspective. I felt very privileged and honored to be able to usher these children through this. I just said to them that this is our opportunity to tell the world your story. And that was a moment where real life and the world of cinema, that line, no longer exists. Am I already? You belong here. We're all very aware how blessed we are to be making this film here in Uganda. The very fact that we were having the opportunity to tell this remarkable story about Fiona was cause for celebration. And I think we were all on the same page when it comes to that. <laughs>